Hello, and welcome back to Cardano Coin, where we bring you the most recent and intriguing ADA news. We're giving away 1000 ADA to those who are watching. All you have to do is upvote, subscribe, comment Cardano is king, and watch the video to the end to be eligible. The winners will be picked next month and publicized on the community page of the channel. Since Mark Zuckerberg officially changed Facebook's name to Meta on October 28th, 2021, there has been conjecture in the cryptocurrency community that this action heralds the beginning of the eagerly awaited metaverse. Up until recently, we were unaware that Cardano and Meta CEO were working together to realize this vision. Welcome back to our channel, cherished viewers. Our goal is to provide you with the most recent information on the cryptosphere and the metaverse. So keep checking back to learn more about this ideal partnership. So let's start with our current topic and see what all the fuss is about. The creator of Cardano, Charles Hoskinson, has expressed excitement about the rising acceptance of the metaverse, which many believe could eventually replace the current internet. Nevertheless, the metaverse has existed for some time. However, it will take some time before the general public warmly accepts the idea of a 3D virtual realm coexisting with their everyday life. But it is reasonable to argue that a cooperation between Cardano and Meta implies far more than the CEOs will concede, going by popularity patterns and the way investors are pouring millions and billions of dollars into the growth of the metaverse. Even the name change from Facebook to Meta was a strategic act. Tokens with a metaverse theme. Sand and mana appear to have erupted throughout the area. In recent years, metaverse has gained appeal, particularly among gamers. People from various areas are eager to update themselves with its expertise now that the cryptoverse has been added to it. Let us remind you that subscribing to our channel is a good idea if you are interested in learning more about the metaverse before we continue with the video. Additionally, if you don't want to miss any updates from us, don't forget to click the bell symbol. Keep in mind, guys, that the only way to succeed in the cryptocurrency world if you are thinking about it more seriously is to stay up to date with it. Investors from all over the world are participating in talks regarding the future of the cryptocurrency metaverse in light of its recent surge in popularity. Hoskinson appears to have great expectations for the sector. Mathematician Charles Hoskinson, a well-known figure in the cryptocurrency community, has been known to strongly support metaverse. Tony Edwards, the host of the Thinking Crypto podcast, once invited him to discuss his opinions on the metaverse. And what's this? The creators of Cardano claimed that the metaverse is indeed quite real. Even though the concept of a virtual, three-dimensional world might not actually exist, it can certainly feel real. However, this can only be done with the aid of cutting-edge AR and VR technologies, which still need some time to be refined. Metaverse is not a novelty item. Even if it might seem far-fetched, there is already such a thing as a virtual world that you can enter. Hoskinson made it clear that the metaverse requires a trust paradigm and a scarcity model when asked what role crypto plays in this. With the advent of crypto, a control layer for the metaverse is required, making crypto crucial. The virtual reality world can be expanded with more recent elements like scarcity and uniqueness. This is where the non-fungible token system, or NFTS, comes into play. As developers work to physicalize the digital and digitalize the physical components of the 21st century, these things are unnecessary. According to predictions, Metaverse will grow to be a sizable product segment for the cryptocurrency industry during the next 5 to 10 years. Additionally, it is anticipated that as the Metaverse evolves, technical marvels will reach such heights that it will begin to feel just as genuine as the physical world around us. Hoskinson also mentioned on the show that improvements in AI interface and semantics would provide the metaverse a distinct perspective. In other words, according to Hoskinson, the advancement of all these technologies suggests that Web 3.0 is a vertical layer that is layered on top of the metaverse. What even does this mean? The answer might surprise you, but consider learning something with just a quick glance. You will be able to overlay digital attributes in the real environment thanks to advancements in AI technologies, AR, and VR. 
For instance, when you gaze at a structure like a restaurant, the AR glasses will display the restaurant's opening and closing times. How awesome is that? Now, although the network's lower car appears to be falling behind and has cutting-edge virtual worlds like Decentraland or the Sandbox, project launches have occurred, according to Lucas, a medium writer. These initiatives appear to have long-term promise. Some of them had been mentioned for your better perusal. We can start by discussing the Cardano Ecosystem's Intoxicated Dragon. This initiative aims to establish itself as one of Cardano's first cutting-edge NFT markets. It has been reported that starting in 2023, the developers of the Drunken Dragon will only work on the metaverse component of the project. The users of this initiative will therefore have access to a business where they can engage in NFT exchanges. They will be able to market in-game components in the Cardano Network's NFT format as well as other NFTTs. This company's core competency will be adventure games, and the NFTS that players will require to complete the game will be promoted as such. The project is currently being reviewed and is still in the planning stages. It is anticipated to debut around 2024. The Cardano Warriors is another such project that will be the focus of this collaboration. It was created as a metaverse game with features similar to XE Infinite, which was introduced on the Ethereum network, and it quickly became quite popular. You will need to play with characters who are themselves NFTs in order to win some game elements that will be handed to you in an NFT format, just like in other metaverse games. Users will be able to sell their stuff to these items will be accessible for sale in a market that is available within the game, which is an intriguing element of Cardano Warriors. The official project website has been finished, and it is styled after the dated, two-dimensional RPG design. However, there is still time before the game is fully developed and released, since it might not be ready until the fourth quarter of 2023. The following group is Hash Guardians. Let us give you a sense of how well-liked this project is. 10,000 NFT-based products made by the Hash Guardians in the Cardano ecosystem were sold during the first sales period alone, and players of the game can win in-game hash currency tokens by participating in it. Gambling is a notable aspect of this endeavor, though. Yes, you read that correctly. The NFT is owned by a user and gambling is a source of passive income for them. The idea is that different tasks will be given to players, and those who perform them will be rewarded with hash currency. Before Hash Guardians is finished, another Cardano project worth mentioning here is the Cornucopias. The first version of the game is expected to be released sometime in the second quarter of this year. Why is it so unique? This project will be the one in the Cardano network that has the most features in common with Decentraland and Sandbox on the Ethereum blockchain. Users of this project will be able to purchase and sell parcels in the NFT format, and as the game's virtual world uses a similar production mechanism to Minecraft's, players will be able to set up shop on their plots, as well as their preference. Simply put, this is a chance to launch an online store. Ladies and gentlemen, we would like to take this opportunity to conclude our video. We sincerely hope you enjoyed it and that it gave you a fresh perspective on the upcoming collaboration of the two brilliant minds to hasten the process of assembling a fully functional metaverse as quickly as possible. If you want to hear more from us, don't forget to click the bell icon and the like button. I'll try to catch you in our next video and wish you well.